What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Jelly Goon TV. Welcome back to my beautiful viewers and subscribers. Today we have another video, but before we get to that, I want to say, please do subscribe and hit that notification button and become a member of the Jelly Goon Squad. Of course, it would be massively appreciated. We are 10,000 strong, almost. So yeah, please hit that join button and join the family. Also, watch the ads on these videos in order to support your favorite YouTuber. Of course, it's really appreciated if you do that. Also, check out the Instagram, Twitter, and Discord, of course. And uh, today, we have a very special video. I know many of my channels is probably going to hate this video or they're just going to comment some shit about Americans or something. So, Americans, please watch out because most of my subscribers are Russians. But I really wanted to know deep in the mindset of what an American think about a Russian. Because now we talk about two different cultures that actually hated each other during the Cold War. So I wanted to dip into what the normal people in America, they actually think about Russia. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into this video. What Americans think about Russia? Do Americans like Russia? I like Russia. I'm not American, but uh, do they? Let's go. Hi guys, this is me Olga. Today I am on Santa Monica Boulevard in Los Angeles, California. I'm originally from Moscow, Russia and today I'm going to talk to Americans to find out what they really know about Russia. They don't know anything. Americans don't know anything this one. They think they know all this, everything Hello. in the world. Hello, hi. What is your name? My name is Carrie Ann. Where are you from? I'm from Portland, Oregon originally. Oh, I'm originally. from LA actually. I'm from New York. What about you? I was born in Connecticut and then went to Miami and just moved here three months ago. Mm, have you ever been to Russia? I've never been to Russia. I haven't, no. I have not. Never. No. One is even no. Hmm. Nope. 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 What about you? I haven't been allowed to leave the country, so no. <laughs> what do you my think? My cousins are from there. Really? Yeah, my cousins were actually adopted from Kazakhstan. Oh, wow. Yay. I'm 50% Russian, but I've never been to Russia. Never. Have you? Are you from Russia? I am actually from Russia, yes. What? What do you think is the most popular drink in Russia? Vodka. Vodka. Vodka? What? Vodka. Vodka? I would have said vodka, yeah. Vodka. 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 <laughs> Probably just, I don't know, is it just like vodka martini or something simple like I'll that? I'll give you a hint. It's actually non-alcoholic at all. Oh, it's not? Mm. Is it a green juice? Some sort of weird, like, soda. Rum? I have no idea. It's actually non-alcoholic. Some standard soda. Like Coke or something, maybe. Let me pause it. You see, this is why people they get mad at me for not knowing what stereotypes are and everything. They think they don't know. But I know that the nationality drink is not vodka in Russia. I understand that, okay? Just to get that clear. But don't blame these Americans. They only listen to the stereotypes. Please don't blame them. Please don't. Let's go. Coca-Cola? What is it? Coke? What is it? No. Water is my guess. Water. Water? Yeah, milk. Really? <laughs> really, <laughs> Chiniqua? You can actually really? add milk to this drink. Coffee or something? Everyone drinks coffee, right? It's like milk or something. Oh. Something to do with milk. It's the tea. You can add milk to the tea. <laughs> oh my god! Yes. <laughs> Why do you guys think there is 11 million more women in Russia than men? I have no idea. It's a very unequal quantity. It's extremely unequal. I couldn't answer exactly why it's that is, to be war. honest. People bring women in. No, it's because of the war. <laughs> <laughs> Either the men or the government restricts how much women are born. Uh, maybe there's just Americans not a lot of, good are so pick ignorant. of guys over there. Chicks but run the world, for real. Women are definitely better than men. Mm -hmm. more women die before, <laughs> women die men, men, or men die, die faster than women. Yeah, Let me pause are... here. You see the mentality? You see the mentality in Americans? They are so spoiled. They are so spoiled in America, it's unbelievable. They don't care who they offend as long as it's not about themselves. You know what I mean? Like, it's funny to see. It's funny to see how they react and how they just don't give a fuck. They don't care about the rest of the world. All they care about is their little bubble around them. That's all they care about. I think it's fucking hilarious. Let's more go. reckless Not every women, American. So they have a higher death rate, for sure. Girls. Maybe there's like um, more men leave Russia, maybe? To do business elsewhere? Maybe. Actually, 11 million more women than men in Russia. Oh my gosh. 
I don't know, but that's a problem. <laughs> oh God, I'm not single. <laughs> yeah, that seems like that seems like kind of a little bit of an issue. Are there a lot of cats, like cat ladies, in Russia? Because they there's not enough men, so all the women just have to have cats to take care of them. I was gonna say honestly because like Russian sperm like creates more women than it does men. I have no idea. Probably has something to do with chance and science and eggs and chromosomes. I think all the men go off and fight and then get killed, right? It's actually the right answer. Yeah. <laughs> it's true, man. It's Politics aside, mm-hmm. what message would you send to Russian people if they come to America? Ooh, the food's pretty awesome. In the entire of America or LA? Entire USA. USA. Mm-hmm. Um, I think Vegas is a place that has to be seen. Well, Disney. Disney, you gotta go to Disney. Hollywood is beautiful, the Empire State Building's great, yes. <laughs> and that's a great We're reason to come. Yay. New York, baby! <laughs> yeah, I would say come to New York City yes. and come to Hollywood, that's it. Food? Um, food's great. Uh, there's a lot of great things here. I think there's a lot of great things everywhere. It's just you have to be willing and open to explore them and accept them. Well, I don't really have... Let me pause I just want to say one thing, what is kind of funny, like... America has so many fucking things, but they take it for granted every time they live, so they can't really name, like, five things that they're gonna experience when they come to their country, right? They can't even say that to a tourist, right? That's kind of crazy, and that's kind of privileged. I just have to say, man, that's kind of privileged. Americans are privileged, black, white, Mexican, it doesn't even give a fuck what you are. You are privileged as fuck if you're from America, I just have to say, man. Look at Afghanistan, look at Russia, look at every Wells, man, goddamn. I've never been to Russia, so I can't necessarily relate to how life is there. But um, as far as life is here in America, I feel like it's great, and I feel like we're very welcoming. At least I am, and at least this area of Los Angeles is. Yeah. So I would say come visit, see if you like it, oh, and women come here because there's lots of men in Los Angeles. <laughs> I don't know if you want them, but they're here. Live your life. It's great here. We're having a grand old time. Live, laugh, love. Yay. <laughs> That's it, sister. Yes, That is awkward. Yeah. Let me pause you, man. That's beautiful. I like to see that, man. I like to see that a lot. Uh, Americans are very ignorant. Americans are very, you know, they are very bad compared to the rest of the world as tourists, as everything, because they think they own everything. They think they have a privilege to do whatever they want to do. They are too stuck in the head with their freedom of speech and all this dumb shit that they have inside of them. They listen to some constitution or something, and the constitution got rewrite it like, what, five times or something like that? Like, they're fucking priv- privilege. It's just, you know, it's so fucking dumb. Like, Americans are beautiful people. I love them to death. Don't get me wrong. America is a great fucking place with a lot of good people. There is a lot of good people in America. But there are some people where you just look at them and you think, what the fuck, bro? Like, why did you even exist? You know what I mean? Not to hate America. They probably have that all over the world. But I'm just saying, America's stereotype is very dumb, ignorant, and stupid, right? So I think she find the right person right there. Just saying. Anyway, guys and girls, if you like this video, please hit the like button down below. And if you really want to support this video, please comment down below what you think about this video. What have you heard Americans say? What do you think about these opinions that was in the video? Please let me know down below. I would love to hear them. It will be massively appreciated, of course. Thank you, man. So, yeah. Anyway, also, please remember to subscribe and hit that notification button to get updated on the newest videos that come to this channel when you become a member of the Jelly Goon Squad. Anyway, guys and girls, I'm going to see you until the next one. Peace.